Shh. Juice cleansing isn't a fad. Shh. It's been around for a long time. The Master Cleanse has actually been around since 1940. Welcome back to my channel, Raising Wellness. My name is Shelby. If it is your first time on my channel, then welcome. I'm so excited to have you here. On this channel, we talk about healthy eats, vegan meal prepping, gratitude, and we also talk about how to actually achieve your dreams and your goals and make life work for you rather than against you. So if you have any interest in any of that, then please hit the subscribe button down below and you'll be alerted every time a video comes out if you hit that little bell that's down there. And I put out videos every single week and I fill them with the best education possible, the most inspiring words possible, and I'm here to help motivate you and lift you up and make you realize that you are wonderful and beautiful and you can live the life of your dreams. So remember, please hit that subscribe button if you're interested, and welcome to this video series. This is an eight-part video series all about juice cleansing, and this is video number seven, as it is the last day of my juice cleanse, and I'm going to be talking to you guys all about the master. What is it, how long you should do it for, and why do it. So let's dive into it. So the Master Cleanse has been around for a long time. It was just recently made famous and put in the media when Beyonce used it to lose weight for one of her films. I believe it was Dreamgirls is the name. And she used it to lose a lot of weight rapidly for that film. And while, yes, the Master Cleanse is good for that, it also has many other benefits and it should be used with caution and used wisely as it is a rapid way to lose weight. and losing weight rapidly can't, it's not always the healthiest. So first and foremost, a master cleanse is when you do a salt flush in the morning, I'll explain more about what that is, and then you drink eight to 12 glasses of lemon, cayenne, water, maple syrup mixture, and then you also do a detox tea at night, which helps is a, another laxative using herbs to actually flush that through your body, and uh, so you have to be very careful with it because you're using laxatives, you are using um, a straight water and lemon cayenne maple syrup mix for your sustenance every single day. And me personally, I'm not doing the salt flush in the morning. Instead, as you can see here, I am using the master cleanse and then I'd say using about 10 glasses of the master cleanse every single day or just for today since I'm only doing one day and then I'm adding the cayenne on top and next I have a g-force which I'm drinking throughout the day and that's typically not in a master cleanse but that one is a uh, it's an alkaline juice and it's filled with a lot of those minerals and green minerals that you need during the day, so it helps to give me a little bit more mineral content, a little bit more nutrient content throughout the day. And then I also made the detox tea, which I showed you in the last video to use during a regular cleanse to help flush toxins out of your system. And the detox tea is made with things like licorice and slippery elm that are gonna help to pull toxins out of your body and push them through and out of your system. Uh, like I said in the first or second video of this series, there's a lot of toxins being scrubbed and moved around in your body and they need to find a way to get out of your system so this detox tea helps that happen. And also the salt water flush that you would usually do, um, that helps that happen as well. But I only steeped a little bit of this because it is a very bitter drink so I'm just going to gulp it down at the end of the day. And yeah, that's what I have for the whole day. The Master Cleanse all together is, just for the lemon cayenne water, is 880 calories. If you're just straight drinking that. So you are at an extreme calorie deficit. Uh, that's why I don't recommend doing it for more than three days. And when you do do it, make sure you don't have any activities planned. Make sure you are just sitting on the couch or hanging out, resting. Today is Sunday for me, so I literally just slept all day. I let my body do its thing, and I just woke up every now and then to drink some of the, the mixture or the G-Force. I also added in a 
third, so probably like four or five ounces of a coconut milk, which is really high in calories, and I put charcoal in there, so that's also just like the detox tea, it's gonna help to pull and draw any toxins out of my system for the last part of this cleanse. And so all together, that's around 1,100 calories. You need a minimum of 1,200 calories a day, so I don't recommend doing this for more than three days. Like I said, because once your body, especially if you've been doing a cleanse before, and once it depletes all its supply in your digestive system, then it goes to your glycogen stores, and once it depletes that, it's going to move on to your protein and your fat in your system, and it's going to help to, um, it's going to pull from that, and it's actually going to make you lose muscle, and it's going to slow your metabolism down. So don't use it for an extended period of time. I recommend to a lot of my clients when they're doing a cleanse to do it right at the end, the master cleanse, to do it right at the end as just like a one and done kind of deal to just flush everything out and then move back into food afterwards. So that's what I had to tell you guys about the master cleanse. My next video is all about what to do after a cleanse because that can be so befuddling but it is so crucial to your cleanse. A cleanse isn't made to make you lose weight or have all these amazing benefits it's meant to help jumpstart you into a diet up to into a lifestyle that's healthier and actually keeps your body clear of these toxins so I will show you guys what I'm going to be doing what you should do and how to actually feel good and feel awesome and extend that feeling even after your juice cleanse so stay tuned for that I'm gonna give you a few updates for my end of the cleanse as well and I will see you guys then